find in this spot? Okay, Mary Kay, so a net this net, and then I'm going to put him in here, and you're going to lift him up. Does that make sense? Hello, sweet pea. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. I know. Can I get you feeling better? I know, I know. Come on, tough guy. Don't rip the furniture. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're adorable. I'll be wise. No tickets, no tickets. It's going to be a lot more lethargic. My pants are falling off. Good job. He's so ready. Alrighty, we'll let Jaime get some shots of him in there. Mike. We received a phone call early this morning from the Marine Room restaurant in La Jolla stating that they had an animal in one of their booths. They also sent us pictures and we were surprised to see a real young sea lion pup that had actually spent the night in this booth at the restaurant. This is a young California sea lion pup that we rescued from the Marine Room restaurant in La Jolla early this morning. When we came across the pup and it was in the booth, right away we called it a micro dog or a micro pup. This pup weighed 20 pounds when we rescued it this morning. It should be about 40 to 50 pounds out in the wild right now. Southern California, specifically San Diego County, has been having very high tides and very low tides. They've also been having a lot of stormy weather. And these pups are looking for high ground and warm areas to haul out for the night. Southern California has also been impacted by an unusual mortality event and an El Nino event that is impacting the food sources for these sea lions. So not only are they looking for high ground, they're also searching out food. It's early on in this animal's rehabilitation and its condition is guarded, but we are cautiously optimistic. SeaWorld's rescue program, its entire goal is to give these animals a second chance at life and return them back to the wild. And that goal isn't just for this small pup, but all the pups that we've rescued.